Welcome everybody, my name is Marcus Stone and in this video you will learn how you can easily add a footer for your site in Webflow. So let's start. What I recommend is the easiest way is just click here on add, click here on layouts and just find footer. Take it and paste it. Now we got like really good footer. You can also add image here. I'm not going to do that because I don't honestly like it. And now let's just change everything here and we will have it. Let's just delete this one, then delete this one here. And let's just contact us. I recommend like look on the competition, how they have it and if you like it. So partners and oh, I don't know terms. So then I would just change the text link on shop and I will click it and I will just click page and choose page and we can go like with a, I don't know, projects. So whenever someone comes here and clicks shop, he will get here. He will get to the project and I would just do it for everything. Also, if you want, you can add like stuff like, I don't know, Twitter, Facebook map, but this is what I don't like. Like the Facebook component or Twitter components are so bad. I recommend better using lsi.com. You will find the link in the description. Just click on it and I will show you this. lsi.com is a really good site for using a widget that Webflow can't do. So when I'm here, I will go to applications. And if you want to create account create there, just click down below in the description. Let's go with the social media and social media icons widget. And I will show you. So let's say that I have this one here and I like it. This is like pretty good. Continue with the template. Now let's go with the layout and let's increase it. The size of it like to 40 pixels. Now we got like Facebook and everything. Uh, I would just link there my account so people can follow. Click save. Okay. And now just copy the code. And also if you want uh, you can choose between light version or basic version and i recommend using all applications that you can we are going to use light for now so when i'm going to here and i will just click here on, on add scroll down and amped look at this okay and i will just paste code okay we have it here so publish publish selecting domains and let's see how it looks like. Let's say that this is everything is filled here. And we will see if it works or if we need to use container here. Okay, let's open it. And let's just scroll down and voila, we got it. Pretty simple. But I recommend pasting the like here. This is much, much better. And now we got like perfect footer. What you can also do is to create the borders or change the background color here to something else if you want. You know, that's a pretty cool thing to have to do. And that's what I would do. So also, yeah, leave it like this. Let's go with the publish, publish selected domains. Okay, and let's open. Scroll down. Voila, we got it. This is pretty cool. Also, what I would do now is to increase the spacing of HTML. So I would go here upstairs like this. And this is cool. So yeah, thank you very much everybody for watching. Have a great day and see ya. Goodbye. And if you have any questions, ask me down below in the comments what else would you like to learn about footer. Thank you.